Don, uh, Don Maeda here with Transworld Motocross. Um, we got the Liat helmet, the GPX helmet, about a month ago at LA County at the uh, initial introduction. And uh, we spent a lot of time in it in the, in the days since. And uh, it's a pretty cool helmet. It's really comfortable. Um, to be honest, when I first saw it, I was looking at it, the size of it, and I thought that it might be kind of uncomfortable and hard to put on. But <clears throat> of any helmet I've worn, it slips on your head the easiest. You don't have to retuck your ears in or anything. Um, it just slips right on. Uh, it vents exceptionally well. A lot of airflow in the helmet. Uh, one thing I will say is initially I didn't think it was that loud, but uh, after wearing it back to back with some other helmets, there's a, quite a bit of airflow noise and uh, you can hear your engine and like your chain slapping around. So uh, I guess if you like a quiet helmet, uh, you wear earplugs like some of the pros do. Uh, Unbelievably, none of us have crashed any yet and slapped our heads in the ground. That's pretty miraculous for me myself. But uh, but um, you know if you if you look into the safety features of the helmet, the uh, injected foam with the uh, the cone-shaped dual density foam in it and the uh, little turbines in there. I don't know if you can see them in there. But uh, also another thing is I actually thought that the turbines might be uncomfortable. Like you might feel these discs poking on your head. But uh, yeah, you don't. It's, uh, it feels like any other helmet when you're wearing it. It's exceptionally light, it's comfortable. Um, I know that Leah showed us some testing data that was very positive and uh, favorable for them. So um, again, without crashing in it or saying it's a lab ourselves, I have to say uh, it's a pleasant helmet and uh, it's one we enjoy.